Matter of fact, we bought two spots, the second of which was canceled by Fox Sports, which was the most wonderful thing that ever happened to us. My name is Bob Parsons, formerly the founder of GoDaddy, Parsons Technology, and still the founder of BXG. The idea to start advertising on television started in about 2004 with GoDaddy. We had grown to about a 16% market share and we couldn't really get much past that. So we started making plans to begin a advertising program on television, radio, and I had the idea, TV advertising, there's the best place to do that would be the Super Bowl. The reason that advertising on the Super Bowl is a challenge, most people, they're in conversations with, with somebody else because the Super Bowl is a social event. We needed something that was a little catchy. Everybody's domain name worked the same as our domain name, so we had to make ours appear to be more fun. The whole idea was to spoof a TV news hearing where this gal was uh, wearing a GoDaddy tank top. We had her tank top strap pop. It was a very small thing to spoof the Janet Jackson wardrobe malfunction. And once we got it done, we sent it to Fox, their standard and practices area, and it was immediately rejected. <laughs> So what we did, we did a number of things to make it comply. We shot most of it from the back. What we shot from the front was at a distance. Her cleavage was blurred. The first ad ran and the traffic we got over the internet was so much that our whole building shook. And then when the second ad was ready to run, Fox censored it. My staff was upset at first, but I turned to my chief of staff and I said to him, can we be this lucky? I did an immediate blog article. We did a press release. The story was picked up all over the world. I did interviews from morning to night on all shows. So did some of our staff. Even the GoDaddy girl was on the Howard Stern show. And our market share jumped after that week from 16% to 25% worldwide, and it held. Best thing we ever did.